start with Roland Dahl. Now we are going to go to the phase of struggle from 1919 to 1927. What was happening during this time? What all happened during this time, 1919 to 1927? We are going to discuss about what all happened during this time. As we have talked earlier, Gandhiji had arrived. Three movements have already been done. Champal, Ahmedabad, Kedah. The order is very clear to everybody. CAK, Champal, Ahmedabad and after that, Kedah. So let's start with 1919. What happened? The first thing that happened was the Rowlett Act. Rowlett Act. Also known as the Seditious Act. Or Sedition Act. Sedition is Koi bhi aapni speaking against the government or working against the government. Sedition. Rowlett Act or Sedition. It was constituted, let's write it down later, let me explain it to you, just show you Now what had happened, just as Rowlett had come down and the British government had said that we need to set up an organization in some way or some look forward for certain reforms in which we can control these activities. The revolutionary act. So this act had to do two things. First of all, how to control these activities, these revolutionary activities. Kaise revolutionary activities ko roka jai? Or iska reason kya hai in activities ka? Second, isko kaise roka jai? How to curb these? The recommendation of Rowlett Act was punitive and full of punishment. Was punitive and full of punishment. Iske liye, after Rowlett Act suggestion, two bills were passed in the Legislative Council. That is, in the Legislative Council, two bills were passed. Out of those two bills, one was rejected and the other one was accepted. Prohibition and uh, Crimes Act. That was the bill. I'll give you the exact name of it. So, one bill was 22 non-official Indian members voted against this bill. But only one person, one Indian one Indian voted for favor of this bill. He was Shankar Nair. Sir, Shankaran Nair. He voted in favor of it. What was there in this bill? Three things were there in this bill. First of all, all the pre-war time restrictions, pre-war time, First World War had happened. So, se pehle jitni bhi war ke during restrictions thi, all these restrictions were to stay. Jitni bhi restrictions thi, they were to stay. Second, you had in this Rowlett Act a to try a person, a bench would be constituted of three judges in the high. A bench would be constituted. Contribute, uh, constituted of three judges in the high and if a person is acquitted or tried upon there could be no further appeal. third thing was there was no further it is also known as the black act it is also known as the black act now let's go back to our constitution article 32 he was Congress or red traditions which is a fundamental right now, Hebrews Corpus says that if any case or in any way a person has been wrongly convicted or something has happened against it, he has the right to appeal. But according to this act, if a person is acquitted or he has been tried for, he had no right to A fundamental right was denied and against this, a lot of people got up and Gandhiji started the Rowlett in form. So what was to be done? It was decided that what the government had done, the government had passed a bill saying that the press censorship act. Ki hume, jo books hai, it should not be distributed. So it was decided that Hind Swaraj, a book written by Gandhiji would be distributed for free. And we will go against the government. What the government has to say. It was decided it was decided that in Delhi processions would be held, people would take part in Satyagraha. On it was actually to be started on 7th of April, but people distributed on 30th of March. It led to a lot of violence. 15 people died during this time on 30th of March, 19. 
So Gandhi ji took a train going to Delhi. Before he could reach Delhi, at the station of Palwal, he was stopped and he was sent back. At the same time, let's go to Punjab. In Punjab, what was happening? You had two main leaders who everybody knows about them. Doctor, Doctor Satyapal and Satyapal Kichlu and so Satyapal and Doctor Kichlu. These two leaders were arrested. And against this, a lot of processions happened. What had happened? I'll tell you the exact situation. A lot of processions had happened in Punjab. These two leaders were arrested. The main leaders were arrested. What were the Kaliji? They were arrested. And against them, processions happened. People, to a certain extent, uh, Europeans were raided. The Europeans staying there were raided. And after this, as you know, Janiyawala Bagh incident happened, where on Vesakhi, that is April 13, 1990, Six, official figures said 1600, more than that, a lot of people were killed in cold blooded murder. By whom? General Law. The conditions were so bad in Punjab at that time, any person walking through the British, if a Britisher was walking by, you had to crawl on your legs the way you do an army. Right? That's how a person would walk. Any Indian would supposedly walk like that in front of them. And martial law was imposed after that. After the arrest, it led to violence. After that, martial law was imposed. And if any European was walking by or any Britisher was walking by, you had to crawl in front of them. And after this, you had Janiyawala Bagh. Janiyawala Bagh is on Pandit Jala. He is, he was a courtier uh, of Rana Maharaja Pritiz. That's how the name Janiyawala Bagh came. Okay, after this, we had Janiyawala Bagh which occurred, General Lord Dyer ke liye commission aya, known as the Hunter Commission. The first Hunter Commission was for, let's say, no, 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 let's go back. Under Lord Mayo, the first official census had been under WW Hunter, unofficial, 1872. After that, the Hunter Commission came for education, under whom? Well, this is some other Hunter Commission which came for Janiyawala. It was a mere eyeball. Nothing happened. There was, and there was, General O'Dyer was considered as a national hero in Britain. According to the Morning Post, it was able to collect 30,000 pounds of that time for General O'Dyer. Nothing happened. Against this, a lot of resentment happened. At the same time, you had Khilafat movement which had stopped. Khilafat, the word comes from Khalifa, which was there in Turkey at that time. So all the Muslims felt aggrieved against what had happened in Khilafat. That is in Khalifa, that is in Turkey, which is considered as the head of the Muslim <coughs> Empire. What was the reason for starting a Khilafat movement? First of all, the Khalifa had been disbanded. The Ottoman Empire had been disbanded. Chote chote took it and the allied powers took some control over it. Second thing, Treaty of Silvers. It was considered as a very wrong treaty for the Khalifa and it destroyed the Muslim right. Third thing, in Arab land, British was trying to spread dissent amongst the Arab itself. So it led to Khilafat movement in Khilafat movement, what had happened? You had two sessions happening. Uh, first of all, Khilafat committee was formed after that, Khilafat conference was held. In which the main people involved in the Khilafat movement were Ali brothers Muhammad Ali, Maulana Muhammad Ali and Maulana Shafat Ali. Said Chodhwani of Bombay was made the president and Maulana Shafat Ali was made as the same. It was decided the non-corporation movement was the term was basically or to coin a term against the Britishers was given by Hazrat Muhammad. Right? And it was decided in Allahabad session that Gandhi ji will lead this non corporation movement. At the same time, Gandhi ji persuaded the Indian National Congress in saying that why should we, we should support Muslims at this stage. It will make us, make us more friendly and whatever promises we have given to them that we will provide for a better thing, it will give us a And it was decided in Calcutta, special session was held for the first time. Otherwise the sessions used to happen in December, I told you. This time a session was made earlier than that, Calcutta session, Anshal Dada Alshwad Rai, where non-corporation movement was taken up 
and after that you had a session in Nagpur under Lagula Chari when non-corporation movement was accepted and the constitution of again Congress was. What was to be done with the Congress? A 15 member working committee was to be formed. First, second of all, 300 people were to be connected with the All India Indian uh, Congress Committee. Congress was to be divided into provincial Congress, that is provinces ke se, according to the linguistic basis. Four annas per person was to be taken from males or females joining Congress above the age of 20. As you know, it was very recently under the Rajiv. Let's go back to Sunik now sometime. It was under the Rajiv Gandhi government where the age of voting was also changed. It was earlier 21 years and it has now been shifted to 18 years. You were not born at that time, but it was earlier 21 years, now it shifted to 18 years, and it was decided to follow. When Congress decided to start with non-corporation movement, that very day Tilak died. Mirat Balgunkar Tilak had died and the world and across India national voting was held, Hartals happened. Right? So what all things happened in non-corporation movement? It wasn't that it was happening in one part. The difference, what we did earlier, Bengal split, what had happened in the division, sorry, partition of Bengal, only thing that was happening, it was happening in Bengal. Sabko Jora the Bengal Bengal. Up it was to happen all over. Kya kya First of all, 800 national schools were opened up. 800 national schools opened up here. All across India. Right? This main, main cheese, the main person involved for this was CR Das. Ha. For non-corporation within the International Congress, a lot of people had a lot of problems also. What were the problems and who all had problems? First of all, Lala Laspat Rai said we should not quit education. CR Das said we should not get, quit any legislator or courts or lawyers. Whereas Madan Mohan Malvi and Mohammed Ali Jinnah said Swaraj should not be asked for so early. Also, another thing that happened was this time. Abhi the Congress ki demand kya hoti thi? Self rule by constitutional reforms. Usko change kiya gaya, ab mangla gaya Swaraj. Now what was asked for? Swaraj by peaceful and legitimate reasons. Peace, now we want Swaraj. Self government we do not want under constitutional reforms. Now we want Swaraj under peaceful and legitimate reasons. legitimate Okay, let's go back to where I was earlier. What was to be done right now? First of all, 800 national schools were Foreign cloth was burnt. And you had even industrialists past participating. And stone made in Mumbai under Kumar Shivani. Huge bone fire was led there. And all the foreign cloth was burnt. Picketing of toddy shops or liquor shops. Liquor shops were red only lucky. And it was so so much was the terror created that what they used to do? They used to have photographs of important, important people drinking alcohol. All over India to sell alcohol, what they did? Photographs of very important people used to drink alcohol. Was the that the alcohol is good, please do not throw it out. So these all things started happening. At the same time, in Punjab at this time happened the Akali movement. Happened the Akali movement. What was the Akali movement? Before this in a Punjab, the head of your uh, golden temple was under Mahans. These were Kodasi Sikhs. U-D-H-A-S-I. These are Sikhs, but they had cut their hair under the Mughals. And Mughals let them have a control over the Britishers with, were in convenience with them, Britishers were happy with them because they were getting some rent amount. All the connection that was coming in the Gurdwara, Britishers were also And this came in, a peaceful moment started known as the Akali. Why did the Britishers accept this moment? Or peacefully give the maximum number of participation in the armed forces was coming from? They did not want anything to happen there. So they accepted all the demands. But it happened after a lot of bloodshed. Not from the Kali movement, but from Mahans. 
It was very difficult. Mahanti used to consider that whatever the property is there in the Gurdwara was this. Or around it. So, of course, when somebody has a lot of money, why would he like to give it away or the control? And slowly, slowly, the Britishers decided to give the control. A very striking feature that happened during this time was when the gates of Golden Temple, the keys of Golden Temple were to be given of the gates, it was given to Dr. Kichu, a Muslim. That showed the brotherhood of six Hindus and Muslims at that time. So you could pretty well see this type of communal position was very normal. There was no problem happening in Punjab. Then in Andhra of Telangana, you had the Rampal Valley under Anuri Setaram Raju, who was a tribal leader. So, what had happened? Forest taxes were imposed on the tribes. They could not cut anything, forest was no longer there. They could not do June cultivation or what we call the sifting cultivation. Forest products were taxed upon. So, this day again, movement started, we are no longer going to pay taxes. And Alu Vishikara Raju, it is believed that he had magical powers. He is also known as Bullet Baba. And he said he is supposed to be Bullet Baba. There were Assamian plantations against workers stood up. J.P. Sain Gupta was one of the main persons involved in that. You had in Malabar, Mukla Rebellion. Mukla Rebellion is basically versus the Jemis. Mukla Ponte, they were the poor Muslim peasants. Jemis were the rich. Uh, Hindu landlords, in case of Chaliti, it became violent to a large extent afterwards. Initially, though, it was very normal. And the leaders there, the main leaders there, they did not let any Jemi or landlord unnecessarily be tortured. But afterwards, it became a communal case. At this point of time, Gandhiji went there and he was able to control the situation. Mukla, who were Muslims, Malabar area, we are talking about South. And then you had Jainis who were the rich Hindu landlords. So all this was happening at the same time. The first leaders to be arrested during the long corporation movement was Siyad Das, who was supposed to be first session come to the Calcutta special session. Uske baad Nagpur mein jam pe rectify kiya gaya, and uske baad jam pe hua Allahabad mein. Now, Siyad Das was to be the president, but he was rejected for only Jaga. You had Hakim Ajman Ali, who was made the president, acting as the president. The first person to be arrested was Siyad Das and Basan Deji. These were the people arrested. So, British acted to something, they started arresting the people. Now, what happened after this? Gandhi Ji had a different thing. He wrote a letter to the Viceroy stating that if you are not going to willing enough to accept our demands, I will start with the second phase of our movement known as the civil disobedience. And it was to be started at Kheda. In Kheda, Gujarat, the position of the peasants was very poor. So he wrote down the letter and he said whether this time our demands should be. But before CDM could be passed, an incident happened known as the Chora Jawi What had happened? The station was torched, policemen were torched, and considering it to be a why did he back out? Because he said violence had happened. And if he was not able to control it right now, and on a large scale, he would not be able to. So he decided to take back the is it clear? Okay. So the right now. Sir, is it 